Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. We are doing cookie week and this is my third and final cookie that I have for you guys. It is a classic staple recipe that you have gotta have around Christmas. It is my vegan gingerbread cookies. It's a little bit different. We're playing with the sugars. We're adding in some almond butter. Instead of a classic sugar, we've got coconut sugar. So the ingredients are kind of fun, a little bit different, and the result is so, so good. I really think you're gonna love them. So let's get into these gingerbread cookies. We're gonna start by making the chia egg. To do this, we're gonna combine ground chia seeds and water, and we're gonna mix this until thickened. We're gonna put that aside and let that sit for 10 minutes. In a large mixing bowl, we are gonna add the chia egg, coconut sugar, almond butter, vegan butter, molasses, maple syrup, ginger, cinnamon, nutmeg, salt, and baking soda. We're gonna beat this with a hand mixer on low to combine. Then in batches, we're gonna start adding that flour until it's really nicely combined. Your dough should hold its shape when it's being pressed, but it's not gonna to feel too dry. I find that one and a half cups of flour was perfect for this recipe. Oh, <laughs> too fast, too fast. Let me just see how this is feeling. Yeah, that feels good. Okay, so this dough is looking perfect now. We are gonna turn it on to our work surface and we're gonna kind of bunch it all together into a nice dough ball. We're gonna wrap that up and we're gonna chill it in the fridge for about an hour or maybe overnight. Okay, so I'm ready to start baking some cookies. We're gonna preheat our oven to 350 degrees and line our baking trays. Let's generously sprinkle with some flour here before we start rolling it out. And then we're gonna carefully roll this out to be about a quarter inch. So I'm just applying some gentle pressure to roll out this dough. If I apply too much pressure, then I risk the dough kind of cracking. Um, if you're finding that the dough is kind of cracking and crumbling too much, it might just still be a little bit too cold. So let it sit for a couple minutes and then try again. Now for my favorite part, we're gonna take our cute little cookie cutters. I've got some fun holiday cookie cutters here. So I've got a gingerbread, some holly, and a cute little candy cane. You can use whatever you have at home. I think these ones are really fun, so I'm gonna use them. Sometimes the pieces like get stuck, so. Oh, his little eye. <laughs> he only has one eye. This part's fun because you can kind of play around with the shapes and then kind of build it so that you're maximizing the amount of dough that you're using by fitting the shapes in where they go best. So we're gonna get that onto our baking tray and once we're done, we can bake them. Oh, he lost his little arm. <laughs> All better. So we're gonna bake these cookies for six to eight minutes or until they appear slightly brown on the edges. Remember that they're gonna firm up as they sit on the pan. Okay, everyone, so there we have it, my vegan gingerbread recipe. This is a classic you have to have for the holidays, and we had a little fun with the ingredients to make it a little bit special, and also how cute are these cutouts. Have fun playing with the cutouts, and get into the festive mood, because these ones definitely make you feel like you're ready for the holidays. Mmm. Oh my god. Perfectly crisp on the outside, soft on the inside, so much ginger flavor, deliciously spiced. These are amazing. If you like this recipe, give it a like, subscribe to my YouTube channel, and make sure that you come back for more vegan recipes with Vegan Afternoon with Two Spoons. I'll see you later, bye.